Hello and welcome back to Rusty Road Trips. Today we're going to be testing the salad bowl. So this one is of my own design. I 3D printed it. Um, we're going to throw it on here and see if it really makes a difference. Um, I am optimistic on this one. I think it actually will do pretty good, but uh, let's throw it on there and find out. Alrighty, so the factory air cleaner, well not the factory air cleaner, the Chrome will get you home air cleaner is installed. So. Let's go take it for a baseline run, see where we're at, and then install the uh, salad bowl. So I got the salad bowl installed, let's fire up and uh, take her for a test run. Well, we just did our test run, so I'll have to go back and uh, take our data and see what we come up with. But I really feel like the salad bowl made a uh, actually noticeable difference, especially in the low end. Um, I'm not sure if that's just because in the higher RPMs we're already, already pulling in enough air that it doesn't really matter, kind of laminar or turbulent. But I think in the lower end, this really helps redirect that air a lot smoother. Um, but uh, I'll do a little bit more research, evaluate our data, and uh, we'll get a conclusion here pretty soon. But I uh, was fairly impressed with the salad bowl. Let's see what the data says. All right, guys, we have the Excel spreadsheet here set up. Um, we have one column here for the normal air filter and one column here for the salad bowl. Um, I did about a 20 mile per hour to 60 mile per hour time, um, as well as looking at the RPM. The salad bowl did outperform the normal air filter setup um, just barely we cut maybe about a second off between the two times here um, as well as we we're able to put slightly more rpm um, i think a little bit more modification on the setup could be made to improve the airflow um, really the whole idea and i looked this up behind the salad bowl uh, adapt from the air cleaner is to create a smoother entrance into the engine um, from the air filter setup. I think the way I had it set up did improve it slightly that we can see here, but I think more improvement can be made by modifying the bottom of the air cleaner more. Um, this is an idea I'm going to continue to pursue and see if I can perfect a little bit. Um, another thing I need to incorporate in there is the PCV valve as well. I had to use the factory adapter for that. Um, but I think that these are promising results and we'll see what we can do from here. I'd also like to add as well that uh, I've been posting as a while as I've been on internship over the summer and haven't had access to the same capabilities to work on things. I've been working on a variety of projects and prototypes for 3D printing, which will hopefully come down the line. But now that I'm back at more of a consistent home base, hopefully I can get some more footage here of what I'm doing and we can uh, move forward from here. But I appreciate everyone tuning in and I'll catch you next time on Rest of Road Trips. Thanks.